Gotta bounce back about two to three times. Dealing with your ass, got me walking over time. Got me some slack, I've been losing my mind. No, I'm not fine, you be killing my fight. Got me down back. guys today is monday and it's about six days or so to christmas i am off to the gym you guys know i usually work out with tatiana on tuesdays and fridays but she has moved my session for this week to monday because she's going to poland today so i'm dressed i'm ready i'm off to the gym to go and meet tatiana so you guys See you at the G. Can't believe I thought you were the one with all the flags waving red from the start. Now I know all the things that I won't think I'm good on my own. Cause I'm That your bad minimum was bad I had to lose it, my feelings muted Put it into what we had without the full closure Cause there'd be times I thought that we could start this all over But now I know I can't do any type of mediocre Used to fall back but now I'm only looking forward Can't believe I thought you were the one of the flags Waving red from the start Now I know all the things that I want Day by day Taking time to myself Can't believe I thought you were the one All the flags Waving red from the start Now I know All the things that I want Think I'm good on my own Tatiana killed me and I killed myself. My body is like dead right now. But we move. We move. I'm really excited. It's Christmas season and it's just so beautiful. Whew. Let's go home. Hey guys, so back home from the gym, fully dressed and Work starts for me in about 30 minutes. Um, today is like my official last working day. So I have a meeting in about 30 minutes and I'm already dressed for my work from home. I'm wearing a t-shirt from Fola Francis. I'm wearing a blue trouser from Primark and my house shoes. I will make a full length video for you guys to see but fully ready for work. Of course wearing glasses because I'm looking at the computer for a very long time. And I usually would do like really tiny earrings from working from home today. I don't feel like wearing a wig, so no wig. And yeah, pretty much ready. My wristwatch and I put some perfume on, basic lip gloss, and that's it. So I have a meeting in 30 minutes, like I said. Um, the boys are still sleeping after all, it's holiday, so I'm just leaving them to sleep till they're ready. But um, their breakfast is ready, so once they're ready and I'm in my meeting, Adam will just um, get his brother. And they would go and eat their food and they would let me be. Of course, they would sort themselves out of their bath and all of that. We already have like a routine for that. So I usually don't have to stress. Honestly, I'm going to use this medium to tell you something. It is important to raise your children in a way that you will eventually have peace. Such that when you're not there or maybe when you're like, you know, not fully available to give them 100% attention, at least the older one can sort of like, you know, take the lead and, you know, they can make decisions the right decisions without you always interfering. Trust me, if you do not, it will stress you out and it just makes your life really difficult. Like, the boys are in the stage where, I mean, I understand that they are a bit older, but also, 
what have I said that they're doing now is a foundation that I have laid before now. So I'm saying, as your kids are growing, be intentional about how you're raising them. Talk to them about things. Let them understand why you do certain things. Let them know why you make certain decisions so that when you're not there, they can recall all of that knowledge, all of that information and make the same decision without you being stressed out, without you being frazzled. You know, the boys know that when they wake up, the first thing to do is, you know, of course, we pray together. But when we're going to school and they have to do their stuff first, they will wake up. Whoever is going to have a bath will go and start having his bath. The other person is already sorting himself because usually we get ready for the week on Sunday. So we, there's no running around like a headless chicken ever in my house. And that's because I know what works for me. I don't do well with last minute stuff. I don't know how people live like you know, by winging their life, I can't do it. So I'm very, you know, I'm a very planned, a very routine person. And that's something I have taught my children. And it has made my life really easy. If you are currently in a state where you're feeling like there's always pandemonium in your house every morning, especially on Mondays, I think, you know, you can try it. this work for me. And I'm suggesting for you to try it. If it works for you, I mean, I would have in some sort of way, um, impacted you positively. So try it out. I'm not saying that off the bat, when you start, you'll be 100%. But at least give it a try. See how much difference it makes in your life. And then you can tweak things around and, you know, change things around from there. So, like I said, I'm off to go and join my first meeting in about 30 minutes. But I need to also go and drink my protein shake because I've come back from the gym. I need to also prepare myself for breakfast. Usually when I go to work out with Tatiana, I would, you know, wait till about 12 o'clock before eating. Because, you know, my body is still full. I don't feel hungry. If I feel hungry earlier than that, I will eat. But... I'm currently not feeling hungry. I'm just going to go and drink my protein shake and some blueberries and get into work. So once the boys wake up, I'll show you guys the things that we get up to. So until then. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this t-shirt from a Nigerian brand called Fala Francis. A hey, Fala. And I'm wearing this trouser from Primark. And my house shoes were from Audi. I really like this pair because they're very, very warm. Let me get, let me show you guys. The inside is so warm. Can you see? Like the inside is super warm and it just makes my life really easy. It makes everything comfortable. And um yeah, so got that from Audi and I think it was about six pounds or so or seven pounds. I can't remember, but yeah, that's why I wear around the house when I'm working for Michelle during winter because I need my feet to be warm. So that's basically what I'm wearing. And I'm just going to grab my laptop now. My meeting is in about 30 minutes and that will be it so i need to get off now and um go and have my protein shake i'll see you guys later bye i finally found myself on the bed because even though the weather is a bit warmer today compared to the last few days it is still quite cold so i had my meeting and i have two people here just being troublesome like when you have these boys that told me it's a different ball game and They've had breakfast, so they've started to harass me. Who are these people? Can you please play a game? Please. 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 Cute eyes, cute eyes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so, what do you guys want? Mm, PS, 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 PS. I want to play on PS. How are we going to share it? Uh, I'm going to have to play on the iMac and I'll play on no. the PS. No! Because we played the PS last time! You started last time and that's no. not fair. He played on the PS last time! So who is going to go on the PS so now? You. Me! Me! Ah, I said me first. Okay, rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 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 Rock, Okay, yeah! Oh, come on! So, so who is going to watch? Who is going to go to the PS? Me first. Oh, they did rock paper, yeah. rock paper scissors. What? Shoot. <laughs> rock Please. paper scissors shoot. And Asha lost, so Adam is going to go on the PS, and Asha is going to go on Roblox on the iMac. So let's agree. How long is it going to be? One hour interval. Yeah. No, it's going to be two hours because No, two hours is too long, Adam. He's a, he's one hour. No, it's not one hour, it's one hour. <coughs> so one hour, so, so, you switch. Yeah, and then you switch again, and then you switch again. It's, it, it's an infinite cycle. Okay, goodbye. No, it's not an infinite cycle. You pay for one hour. You pay for one hour. 
Adam will play for one hour, and then both of you will then, after one hour each, you guys will come back to me, and then we find out what's the next thing to do. You can't be there for infinity, Asha. Okay? No, no Mama, until we go to bed. No, you can't. You're going to spend the entire day playing game. Are you joking? No, we're going out briefly. So go and do one hour each, and then you guys come back to me. Deal? You know, it's fine. See you guys later. Ah, I don't want to. Ah. Deal. See you guys later. See Bye. You guys. Bye. Guys, we're fully dressed. We're tired of being at home. And we decided that, you know, we'll go and eat lunch out. So we're going out to a restaurant in Meeting Kings to go and have lunch. We'll be like, late lunch, stroke, almost dinner. But hopefully when we come back, the boys will still have something else because I, I, can, I can be rest assured that they will still say that they want to eat something. Ada, where are you? Here. Come here. So I'm going to show you guys what we're wearing. I pretty much just switched my outfit from what I was wearing before. No switch. I just added a jumper to what I was wearing. Let me switch the camera. So we're all dressed and... Asha, step forward. Let's see you. Asha has his Christmas jumper on. His denim and he's wearing... Some trainers and oh yeah, move away. Let me step forward. So I'm wearing I threw on this jumper on top of what I was wearing before. Still wearing my pants and I've changed into trainers. Adam, step forward for us, please. Okay, so Adam has his Christmas jumper on. Can you please pull this up a little bit? Yeah. His Christmas jumper. He has denim and then he has his um Air Force. So pretty much this is what all three of us look like. Actually, can you step forward? This is what three of us look like. So this is our, um, is it late lunch? Late lunch, yeah. stroke, early dinner outfit. Anyway, guys, off to the restaurant. Bye. 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 If spring is the season that wakes me alive, then fall is the season to contemplate life, oh. Yeah. I don't know what is it exactly in this time of year that makes the melancholy me reappear, oh. I mean, it's, yeah, it's yeah, our yeah. first time here, so you take garlic bread. Asha has oh, yeah. chicken skewer. Oh, yeah. For starter, yeah. I don't know. I'm going to have a look. Starters. So starters. Um, yeah, you guys have so much more than us. Yeah. yeah, but that's what it's meant to be. I'm going to have um, salt and pepper crispy squid for starter. And um, I haven't decided on my. Yeah, pineapple is Asha's. Thank you. Thank you. Oh goodness. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Let's see what is inside. So we have a spring, like a key order type thing in there. Yeah. Actually, let me see what you have. No, no, don't pour it out yet. Yeah? I shall got marbles. Oh. It is one. And, and some drink. No, what does it say? What, 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 what did the pencil say to the paper? What did the pencil say to the paper? I dot my eyes on you. Oh, I got my eyes on you. Oh, I dot my eyes on you. Nice. 
Asha, what do you have in there? Let me see. You're going to read it. Okay, go on then. What did the man say to the kids? What did the man say to the kids? So tell us. Please close the door and dress it. Oh! Please close the door and dress it. Still feels like summer, but it's soaked in nostalgia slowly. All the leaves are turning. Say goodbye to summer I keep on forgetting times learn how to fly And before I know it, it passes me by Sasha, do you like it? Adam, what do you think about the burger? It's really good. It's really good. What do you think about the size? Right. And you like the taste, right? Really nice. Okay. Thank you for taking us out for lunch today. Oh, you're welcome, baby. Look, I made you a flower, even though it's not actually a flower. I made you a rose. Oh, rose. you made me a golden rose, even though it's not a flower. Oh, thank you so much, baby. Thank you. Thank you, okay? <laughs> oh my god. See your teeth, Sasha. <laughs> Did you enjoy the food though? Good. Gotta bounce back about two to three times. Dealing with your ass, got me walking over time. Got me some slack, I've been losing my mind. No, I'm not fine. You've been killing my fight. Got me down back. We had a really nice time at the restaurant. Unfortunately, my camera died. The extra battery that I took with me, apparently it wasn't the charged one that I took. I tried to film a few things with my phone. Yeah, you know, it's not, I mean, you can't easily tell the difference. Anyway, we had a really nice time at the restaurant. We were back home. The food was really good. Even though when the bill came. <laughs> hey, you guys, when the bill came. Anyway, um, I have no regrets because the food was really good. It was a nice time. We hadn't gone out at all, like me and the boys, for, you know, the Christmas period. So I just thought, you know what, usually Christmas is very dead here. So why not, you know, spend that time out? We really had a nice time. Like I said, again, food was good. The ambience was good. The staff, really, really good. I think, you know, we will go back. Actually, Adam and Asha said, Mommy, can you please review this, this restaurant on Google, Google's Guide? and give it a five star we really like the food and we would like to come back so i mean if my children say that they like something you can tell that it is really good because both of them have really really good taste in food so we had a nice time at browns and we've been back home i'm currently just you know just lying down my bed and just you know messing around on social media i just using that to relax a bit and before i finally retire to bed you know, we've had a really nice day and I hope that you guys enjoyed our, you know, not so busy day. Hopefully tomorrow I will have less work to do and 
you know, we would um, step out again. I'm not sure yet. If we go out, definitely I will vlog. But if not, I'll just show you guys whatever it is that we get up to around the house. But other than that, I'm tired. I'm trying to retire now. The boys are somewhere around the house. I can't even get them to even close out the vlog. But whatever it is, guys, thank you so much for watching today again. Good night. Hi, guys. Today is Tuesday. And it feels rather unusual because usually on Tuesdays, I always go to work. But festive mode is in full swing. And I just feel quite lazy. Anyway, I just received this from... AliExpress. I ordered some items from AliExpress and it has just come. So I'm going to unbox it for you guys to see what I got. It's basically workout stuff. I know that a lot of my workout items, I needed to change them. Some of them, you know, they've done, they've done their lifespan. So I got a few things and I'm just going to unbox it. I think I bought it. I think majorly what I bought was more bras. So let's quickly um, unbox this and yeah. Um, other than that, the day has been a bit quiet. I had one meeting in the morning and then the boys have been around. They are currently outside in the garden playing and I'm just inside here trying to finish up, you know, some of the things that I want to do for like a year and recap and things that I also want to do in the new year. So I'm just trying to spend time to, you know, reflect and do all of those, you know, year-end reflection and introspection kind of stuff so so that is adam and asha playing football adam does it feel cold though it's not really no. cold the weather the is really I'm warm because i'm in god and i don't want to harm myself oh okay so the weather is really warm today asha is actually wearing just t-shirts adam i thought you guys had people with you i didn't know it was just the two of you Okay, that's fine. So guys, this came from AliExpress. This is the side of the bag. I'm going to pop it open and then we'll have a look at what is inside. And like I mentioned, it's basically um, workout clothes, tights, and all of that. I've taken them out of the bag. Uh, this is how they are packed. So I got these shorts. I already have, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you already know I have these shorts in brown. And I found out that it's been really, really good. It's very good for squatting. It's also very good for any kind of worker. And it was like next to nothing. So I have it in brown and I really like it. So I ordered it in several other colors. So I ordered this in purple. I also ordered it in orange. I ordered it in pink. And I ordered it in gray. And uh, I ordered it in green color so i bought five different colors of these shorts and um i also bought these tights but this one is longer especially because the weather is a bit cold now i got this one too and the other thing that i got is bras i realized that a lot of the bra tops i used to wear i don't know whether it's that my breast has grown bigger or whatever i don't know but they become a bit small for me and some of them are just actually very old so i got these x back one from the same brand it's supposed to be a navigation jeep or whatever it is i don't know but i read the review and everybody said it's really good that it holds really well because i always like like bras that have like really strong support so i bought these in different colors to match this one is to match the brown pants i've had before then the shorts that i bought i bought matching bras for them so for the pink one i got these pink bra and i think it's going to be super cute just imagine what that will look like with super cute and um, i bought that style of bra another style of bra that i bought is this one with the x back and the bra hook thing because i feel like this would give me like a stronger support compared to that one i don't know until i try it but i bought this one and i bought this one in i guess two different colors i'm not sure Oh, well, maybe I bought only one of that. Oh, wow. I think I bought only one. Okay, I bought only one in this orange color. And I bought it for this shot. So, I'm going to try this orange one. And try maybe a, a, the pink one for you guys to see. So, you see what it looks like. But, just imagine what that two would look like together. It would be really nice, right? Let's try it on. I tried the pink one. 
this is what it looks like on me oh I, I kind of think it looks really nice although i feel like the the bra top is not as tight as i expected it to be the short i the last time i bought it i bought it medium and after a few days i noticed that it was feeling a bit big so i picked a small this time please ignore this dog i don't know which dog that is so this time around i took a small and i don't think it is bad at all I don't think a small is bad at all. I think a small looks really good, but the bra is a bit loose and then the padding in the bra is just running up and down. But other than that, I think it's good. I'm going to try the other bra type so that you guys can see, but let me show you my back. I hope you guys can see the back. If you want me to leave you a link to the seller I bought them from, I'm happy to. So just let me know in the comment section. I think they were like, they were super affordable very very affordable so i've also gone to change and i'm wearing the orange one now this is the orange one the style at the back of this top is different from the other one and i feel like this this bra is firmer the padding inside is better than the other top the other um top and then i'm going to also turn around so you can see the back they have this hook thing at the back and i kind of think that this will do a better job because it actually looks um it looks a lot more a lot more um, firmer on the body so I think this is such a beautiful pair and it's super cute super cute I feel cute in it actually I really do like it so yeah let me know what you think do you like it do you prefer this one like this bra and the back to the other first one I tried on let me know which one you prefer out of the two hi guys so today is Wednesday and we're still in festive mode and um, I just received a few items. Today has been pretty basic for me. I went to the gym as usual, came back, um, the boys woke up, had their breakfast and all of that. I had my own breakfast too. Um, I logged into work briefly just to check if I had any email from anyone that was important, none of that. And um, I just received some items and I wanted to show you guys because it's pretty much like the week before Christmas, or just that, that Christmas week, I found that we tend to receive a lot of um, packages like gifts or things that I've ordered and all of that. So anyway, these two items came, and one of them is in this package. It's supposed to be a book. I ordered this from, I think it was from eBay. And then another package that came is this box. This box also came from ebay and let's unbox it quickly so the first item this is it and i'm just going to so i ordered this book from ebay it's called battlefield of the mind um my therapist recommended this i just wanted to read it so i got that and the second item i need to find something to open this box so, the second item is right here. If you guys can see it, that's what it is. I think I mistakenly turned it upside down. So, the second item is this. So, I got this off of eBay of someone that um, said they bought it and they didn't want to use it and you know why buy a new one when I can save some money off the one that somebody already had so I got this Sigma 16mm 1.4 because the space that I film my sit down videos is very small and I've always struggled with you know being able to film there properly so I decided you know what well, let's buy a better lens so i got this now this is the second lens i've i've gotten for myself this week i got this one and the current 22 mm i'm using to film this vlog which has been a life changer i'm not even going to lie you guys this 22 mm that i'm currently using for this vlog right now is amazing and then i also got this for my sit down videos and i think it's pretty good i saved so much you guys if i tell you how much i paid for this so I, yeah i got this for myself so that also came so those are the two items that have come today and yeah i'm just going to get back into 
I have a few things I wanted to do. Some people sent some items to the boys. And I just wanted to get them wrapped up. I'm one of those people that will wrap everything and put it under the tree. So I'm going to go and wrap my children's um, gifts that came from their friends. And be right back. Hi guys. I already told you guys that um, the Christmas week, so many deliveries. These came two seconds ago. And I decided I'm not going to keep anything. Once they come, I'm just going to pop them open. So let's open it. I'm actually not sure what is in here. Oh. Oh, wow. So I ordered this um, storage rack, adjustable freezer rack. So you basically, so you guys can see right there, you basically just pop it open and you slide it into your freezer. So, because I noticed that the boys keep throwing things around there, like the freezer is a little bit scattered. So I just wanted something that would make it more tidy. So I ordered this. Oh wow, it looks really tiny. Oh okay, no, it's the extendable one. Let's open it and see. I told this person, this vendor, that I would like some white, but anyway, whatever. Um, the other thing you got, I got this off of eBay. So I will pop one out, and that's what it looks like. It's actually very very small compared to what it looks like on eBay itself. So basically what you need to do is to pull it like that. When you pull it, this is how big it is. This is how wide it goes when you pull it out. So basically I would just go and pop it into the freezer. I raise this up and then push it into the glass in the freezer. It's actually nice, it's not bad at all. I just wish that it was all white or maybe it was just like just one color. Got that in the post, part of my Christmas week shopaholic behavior but this is very valid you know it would be nice to put this in the fridge and put some grapes in it so that the boys will stop throwing things around in that fridge like sometimes i just go there and i'm like oh, you guys anyway so i got that green pink and blue so there are four colors excited come on asha so this is us trying out the 16 mm lens that we just got and it's super close to my face and it's oh it's so good. Wait, it's really really good, Asha. Yeah, let's try a bit further. Yeah. Um, but it's a bit hev it's heavier than the twenty-two mm one. Let me try. It's too eh? Don't let it fall off. Come on. Let me try. Okay. No, like come kill over she bye. What you wanna do? I wanna carry it. Okay, come on, carry it. It's quite heavy. Compared to the 22 mm, come this way first. Sit down first. Ah, because I beg, oh, I'm not doing a rough play with my lens. I beg. Can you see it's heavier? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, it actually <laughs> feels heavy. Yeah, it's actually very heavy compared to the to the 22 mm. So now I have a 16 mm lens and it feels so good yeah. because the room where we film downstairs, when I where I film my sit down videos, is very very small. So this is the perfect addition to my. To my content creation gadget i'm super excited yeah yay Mwah. hi guys so i just received this from dhl and this is a cargo from nigeria you guys already know my cargo person is virtue cargo and i, I put her information somewhere in one of my posts or one of my videos if you still want me to share her information i'm happy to share so this package contains Blah, blah blah granites toothpaste pepper yam flour whatever it's basically nigerian food so i'm just going to unbox it and show you guys what i have in here quickly in this box they sent me some items first of all my supplements my creatine from lagos and uh, my pre-workout i also requested for double about toothpaste um, I asked them to buy me some lip glosses. This is a tagungo or oh, dry paper. It's granite. Oh my god, this is very big granite. They taste so good. I didn't want a lot. And then I also got yam flour, aka elubo. 
better quality than what we find here um what's in here okay that's crayfish i didn't really buy a lot i still have some of these things i just then they sent me some pieces from desire 1709 um oh also fish they bought me some dry fish it's basically just things that i don't have that i requested for because i still have a lot of things i still have Bomo and all the other stuff that i usually um buy so yeah that's pretty much what is inside this box and um yeah that's all guys that's it my cargo from nigeria i'm really excited about the fish actually we're out again i've been brunt bounce back about two to three times dealing with your ass got me walking over time got me some slack i've been losing my mind no i'm not fine you've been killing my fight got me down by Can't believe I thought you were the one All the flags waving red from the sky Now I know all the things that I want Think I'm good on my own Cause I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good Cause I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good I'm independent, you hard-headed Too damn confused about what we had Shut up and say, but I was foolish. That your bare minimum was space. I had to lose it, my feelings muted. Put it into what we had without the full closure. Cause there be times I thought that we could start this all over. But now I know I can't do any type of mediocre. Used to fall back, but now I'm on a looking forward. Can't believe I thought you were the one. All the flags waving red from the start. Now I know all the things that. Friday and we're going shopping. I also have my friend here, Ife and her children, and we're all going out with the boys because you know, just to go out with them. But I'll be honest, I'm not looking forward to it because when you go out with children, especially on a day like this, today is the 23rd of December, it will be really busy. I'm currently thinking about where are we even going to park in the city because it will be so busy. But anyway, guys, let's go to the city. Come with me. We're going in my friend's car because, of course, it's a bigger car and we have four children to deal with. So we can't take two different cars. You guys, this, car, this door is not properly locked. Okay. So all six of us were headed to the city. Ooh, everybody say hello. 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 Oh, I can't see you guys. Okay, if I is there. And I got the boys and joy and praise. Where are you? Say hi, praise. Hi, praise. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Praise he said hi, hello, praise. Say hi. Praise, say hi. 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 Cheers. 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 Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I'm not really looking forward to going to the city. I won't even lie because parking might be an issue. But anyway. 
We go anyway. Go in God's name. At least it's better than just being in the house with the children because these children are already they're already tired of being inside the house. I can I can I can tell. So off to the city. How does anybody glow this much though? How does anyone glow this much? If the Christmas glow! We've gotten to the city. We actually went somewhere first and then we bought plantain chips. Oh! Gosh, you guys, this is like, this thing tastes like red oak. If you know red oak plantain chips in VI, Lagos, Nigeria, this thing tastes like red oak. It's so, it is so good. It is so good, you guys. So we bought some of these. This one is the one with the pepper. And then there's another one with salt. This is not my favorite one. I really like the one with the pepper. And I always prefer this one. Yes, praise. Adam Sanch. Adam, yeah. are you looking for his trouble? No. Okay. You guys, going out with the children, going out with children is always an extreme spot. Ah, I told you, Fair, let's put the children, <laughs> let's go and put them in childcare. She refused. She said we must carry them. <laughs> yeah, but I don't have energy. It's somebody that gave it to me. So me, I, don't <laughs> to, I don't used to deceive myself. I used to plan myself because these children, they will give somebody a headache. Oh anyway. Way. <laughs> They've been arguing, arguing, arguing since. I don't have energy. I told this woman she did not agree. Anyway. We're jumping out of the car Let now and going into the shops. Let the older ones do Pray it. for me. Guys, wish us luck that these children will not stress us out. Because me, I will leave them. With the fair in the market, I will leave them. I will leave them. Anyway, let's go. I will just sit down and cry. <laughs> eh, sit down and cry. See these ones. See my babies. I'm not sure what they're all talking about, but whatever it is. It's okay. <sighs> Weather is absolute rubbish right now because it's barely three o'clock and it's already getting dark, like dark, dark. It's just weird. Excuse me, do you want anything from the African shop? If I do you want stuff from here, are you sure? All right, go on then. Got me some slack, I've been losing my mind No, I'm not fine, you've been killing my fight Got me down by it, I to learn the hard way Say you want me, then keep playing this game I'ma need you to stick count of your days No, you can't stay, get up out of my way Can't believe, I thought you were the one All the flags, waving red from the start Now I know, all the things that I
rice is because this is not jollof rice. This southern rice from KFC is absolutely rubbish. Listening beneath the heat, evening swirl into a bright song beat. Got it now, so very bittersweet. So I guess I'll just put on my favorite sweater and say goodbye to summer. I keep on forgetting, times learn how to fly, and before I know it, it passes me by. Oh my god, you guys were back home, and if I tell you that. Picking the right environment or picking the right area to live in the UK is super important, guys. Never ever ignore that. So while we're out, delivery came and they dropped something at my entrance. Usually, you know, I mean, depending on the kind of area you live, I've seen people in recent times talk about the fact that delivery came and dropped stuff at their door. And before they came downstairs from their house, someone, you know, came and just grabbed the bags. Anyway, let me show you guys our delivery. So as we came, this was at our door and nobody touched it. So when you are deciding where you want to live in the UK or where you, when you are picking the area to live, one thing I, I always say to people to consider is the crime rates or how safe the environment is. Where I live is very safe. Nobody steals anything here. They don't steal nothing. You will come back and meet your stuff and, you know. Yeah, so that is it. If you ever have to make a choice of where to live, consider the crime rates. Adam did what? Right when I was next to you. Oh, Adam farted. Oh, I did do. I, I, I was one inch next to him, one inch next to him, uh, and then he farted. <laughs> <laughs> Not even down the road. <laughs> 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 These two people, I cannot deal with them. Anyway. Like I was saying, if you're ever considering where to, you know, if you're trying to choose where to live in the UK, one of the things that you want to consider, like for real, is the crime rate in that environment. I'll save the places. If you're not sure, you can check on Facebook. You can check on Nextdoor. That's an app. You can check on Google. Just type crime rates in social area. He would really help you. Like this environment, my children will leave their bicycle out. We'll never worry about somebody stealing it. So much. It's very important, very, very important. You really, really should consider it. I can't hear the song again. I gotta be joyful. Joyful. <laughs> joyful. Joyful. <laughs> ah. that's a, that, no. I have such a beautiful voice. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. I gotta be 